if there was a dangerous constitutional amendment, it was the BBI. Because it could have installed the imperial presidency that Kenyans fought against for 30 years. If you have a president who can influence the National Assembly through appointments to the executive, and you have a president who can influence the judiciary using the ombudsman, then we are back to the imperial presidency that we fought against for 30 years. We would have gone, we would have been a zero sum game. And that is why I am saying, Tunamushkuru Mungu, he rege mahakama ilisimamisha. Nimesema nataka kuomba msama kama kuna watu wanaona sija wafanya vizuri. Naomba msama. Lakini, mimi nataka niseme, siwezi kurudi nyuma, sina nafasi ya kubanduka, mimi ni kwenda mbele na kwenda mbele. Kwa sababu, mimi ni nasema, Kenya hii lazima tuibadilishe. Kenya hii hatutaki eti Kenya iwe ni sisi viongozi. Tunapanga kubadilisha katiba, tugawane vyeo, tugawane mamlaka. Ilihali wa Kenya mamilioni fijana hawana ajira. Wa Kenya mamilioni wa biashara ndogo ndogo wanaangaika. Haiwezekani lazima tutengeneze Kenya inayotufaa sisi zote and that is my position i will continue to say i will apologize to anybody who feels uh, i have offended them but i am sorry i have no space to retreat and i don't have the luxury of surrendering i am marching forward because we want to transform this nation. We are not going to continue the game of changing the constitution so that we can share power and share positions. We must begin to not to be selfish, but to think about the millions who have no jobs. We must begin to think about the ordinary citizens who are struggling with small businesses. And it is possible for us to improve their lot so that we can have a Kenya that nobody is left behind. And on that mission, I want to say, I am not about to surrender, and I am not going to retreat. I am marching forward.